Hey guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello. Hi, Ursha Kids, if you're not new. What's up, gang? I appreciate you guys for coming back, y'all. Today's video is going to be my empty apartment tour. Woo! I'm super, super excited. This has been a long awaited. Finally, I can say that. Um, for a lot of newcomers that's new here, hello, hi, I'm Shakira Simmons. But for a lot of y'all don't know, I was in the shelter for seven to eight months, so this was long awaited and long overdue. Um, so yeah, I'm super, super excited to show you guys. Spoiler alert, I did show this apartment, if y'all know, okay? So now that the reveal is out now, I can tell you guys, the apartment that I did choose was the last apartment. I believe it was apartment four or five. But like this one was the best option because this one was referring me to this house of connect. So as soon as everything processed, is more quicker versus, you know, trying to get an apartment on Street Easy and stuff like that. Like I did apply to one apartment on Street Easy, but they never got back to me. So I don't know. Congrats to that person that won any of those apartments, but yes. But anyway, y'all. So yeah, y'all, this is the empty apartment tour. I hope you guys like the video. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Um, I'm just super, super excited to know what, you know, this is going to be my new journey. So, and definitely we're going to be, I'm going to be bringing y'all along with me. So comment down below if you guys are excited for the moving vlogs, the, the apartment videos. Let me know in the comments if you guys are excited. Please let me know what type of apartment videos you guys would like to see. Hopefully after this video, the moving vlog will be editing because I'm, I was focused on getting this video out because... You know, it's the empty apartment tour, baby. We got to do this. But yes, the moving vlog is going to be coming after this. I just got it edited. So yeah, y'all, I'm super, super excited. And this has been a long awaited. So yeah, y'all, let me know in the comments what you guys think of the apartment. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And comment down below what apartment videos you guys want to see from me. Because it's only up from here, y'all. Ah! I was super, super excited. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And... Yeah! <laughs> okay, so we're gonna start here. This is my front door and you just walk in. I don't have like a regular key, but I put a pin code and yeah. So you walk in, all right? This is my kitchen. As soon as when you walk in, let's lock the door. So as soon as when you walk in, here's my front door right here. Excuse the trash, I don't have any trash cans, so yeah, just excuse that. Like I said, I don't have much, but you know, we're gonna do what it does for the spaces right now. So as you see here, this is my intercom, where this is the main door, monitor, D&D, &D, where I can basically buzz you in. Here, this is for the light. This is for this light right here and these two lights as you can see right here um and here's my fridge this is my cabinet unfortunately i can't reach any of these cabinets up here um so i bought like a step stool to help me like reach and hard to reach places so up here i currently have my cereal up here this cereal box is too big so that's why i leaned it down like that like look it's too big I can't go up there and as you know I'm too short and I'm pretty sure I can't reach up there so that's why I put it like this diagonally um these are my most favorite cereals the Reese's Puff the Captain Crunch peanut butter of course because oh hello and the Frosted Flakes comment down below your favorite cereal and these are some as you know <laughs> as you can see I'm a fan of Captain Crunch so I got these cereal bars for when I'm rushing out to work but yeah that's this cabinet up here so up there is going to be like cereal and stuff like that and then this is the top of the fridge where i have one garbage bag up there and then this is my fridge so it opens this way and like i said y'all don't have much here because only been a week of us moving in here so i got gatorade the whole shebang juice all of that um yeah that's my fridge and this is my freezer, which is super cute because it has the drawers where, you know, you can put stuff in, which is super cute, okay? 
So those are my, that's my freezer. And here is my sink. Pay it no mind, because don't judge, it's just me. Um, <laughs> so here I have cutting boards. Um, how I'm gonna decorate here, like right here in this section, I feel like I want to put like some lights here, definitely like up here for in the middle of the night and put like some decor here, like my name or something. Like, I don't know, we're figuring this little section out. So yeah, just up here I have mis miscellaneous stuff. I would put the bread, I should put the bread up here. Let me see, instead of leaving it here. Oh, okay, so it fits perfectly there. So I'll put the bread right there. Um, so yeah, just here, just have miscellaneous stuff up here, like um, some snacks. I do have a can opener here. Um, the reason why I put it here is because the drawer that I want to put it in is like, it's not clean yet. And I kind of want to, and it's kind of big, but we're going to get into that drawer later. Um, with my forks and spoons, I want those to go in this drawer, but I want to kind of get the drawer soon. I don't know. We'll figure that out. But so this is my cabinet where I have the pots and pans at for right now um normally i'm gonna keep the pots and pans down here but i'm gonna like an organizer for my pots and pans so it's easier to you know quickly grab you know instead of putting them in here i don't like that look but hey y'all so it's editing kia um it's been weeks since i filmed that video um the empty apartment tour but i just want to chime y'all in really quickly because i've been getting so much insight really quick so i'm gonna flip the camera around and basically explain to y'all just give me one second so as of right now um from when i filmed the video i did have my pots and pans up there so as of right now i do have all my plates because if y'all haven't seen already make sure y'all stay tuned for the moving moving vlog is gonna be after the empty apartment tour so i did have some plates from when I was staying with my dad in Yonkers. So he gave me some of the stuff that we did have, that we did purchase. So some stuff is up here instead. So I did get this little controversy. So everything up here is going to be plates. But here's the controversy. A lot of people tell me to don't put my pots and pans as you see here. I put my pots and pans down here. But I originally wanted to put my pots and pans in this cabinet because of the simple fact I have open in space right here versus this, I have a shelf because the organizer is gonna come up and clearly it's a shelf right here and it's gonna hit it. So, um, and I just rather put my cleaning supplies over here, but a lot of people put their cleaning supplies under the sink. Comment down below. <laughs> What will you do, okay? Because a lot of people tell me to put my cleaning supplies under the sink and put my pots and pans in this cabinet here, but I kind of want to flip it around because the simple fact of the organizer, I want to put in there under the sink versus here because it hits the because it hits the shelf right here. And yeah, I don't know. Comment down below like what y'all think. Comment down below what you guys think and what do y'all put in y'all cabinets? Like, do y'all put y'all cleaning supplies underneath the sink or do y'all put it in like another cabinet next to the cabinet under the sink? Let me know because a lot of people's like, normally like a normal person will put their cleaning supplies under the sink. But I always did that before, but because of the, the shelving in the second cabinet, it's like, I wanted to put my pots and pans there so it's easier to like, you know, pick up and grab and cook and stuff like that. But let me know in the comments what y'all think. Should I put the pots and pans under my sink or should I put it in the next cabinet next to it with the shelf? Let me know in the comments and should I put my cleaning supplies under the sink instead? Let me know in the comments because I think I'm going to just leave my cleaning supplies under the sink. But it's just looking like that for right now. But yeah, let me know your thoughts down in the comments because a whole bunch of people was like, why did you do that? Why are you going to do that? Normally, people will put their cleaning supplies under the sink and then put their pots and pans in the next cabinet. But I have a shelf there, so I don't know what to do. But <laughs> I thought that was a little funny input. Um, I actually forgot to mention in the video, but let me know your thoughts. <laughs>
yes, I just wanted to mention that to you guys, but let's get a crack in back with the empty apartment tour. Yeah, but this is what we have for right now. I did get these Dollar Tree glasses, which is super, super cute. Like, look at this. It is so cute. Like, come on, come on. For the bargain of the cost, it's like 125. You better go to Dollar Tree and get you some glass cups. But yeah, I only got four. So I have another black one, but that one is cracked. Um, so yeah. And then here, this is another Dollar Tree glass cup that we got. Super cute. And the, again, these are the pots and pans and plates that the shelter had gave me to think, like, you know, start off. Um, I don't think I'm gonna keep those. I don't know. I want a whole different pot set to go with the aesthetic for the kitchen. So yeah, those are what's up there. And I don't have anything on the top shelf because simple fact I can't reach up there and I feel like I want and I shouldn't put anything up there because then keep grabbing the, the, the stool is kind of annoying to grab pots up there. So this is kind of like where my canned goods is gonna be at and like my rice and everything is gonna be so i have noodles here miscellaneous stuff like canned goods some of these stuff came with me from the shelter so i got pancakes etc i got some oatmeal right there and i have my seasonings right here i kind of want to get like a a seasoning organizing kind of thing from amazon so they're gonna just have to do in there for right now and I'm planning to make some tacos. So I have tacos and sasson. That's when Anna was here because she loves sasson. And I have a box of rice. That's what the bends in there in the back is about. Um, so yeah, that's that for that cabinet. And I currently have my laptop here. And I have these here because I have to recycle. So I just have these off to the side. So this is my stove right here. As you know, it's an electric stove. As y'all see, y'all gonna see in the, the moving vlog, we were struggling to like even work this because this is new for us New Yorkers. Like we don't operate with electric stoves. So yeah, I'm, I was brought up on gas stoves. So this was kind of new for me to even work, but yeah, this is my stove right here. And then right above that, you have my microwave, super cute, really spacious. Oh, I got my beef patty in there. So I was gonna eat it after I filmed this video. So it's just cooling down right now. But yeah, this is my microwave, super cute. It has everything here that you can be able to use like center cook, popcorn, reheat, etc. And you see me? Listen, baby, if y'all starting a YouTube channel, you better start with your phone, okay? Period. And then this is the little timers of how much you wanna set it on for like one minute. And then you start it for 30 seconds and then cancel if you wanna cancel. But yeah, that's for that for right now. So this is my kitchen, honey. This is my kitchen. Hopefully when I have everything like cleared out, I'm gonna do like a montage overall look of my apartment when it's like more neater and everything. But I kind of like am rushing to do this apartment tour cause y'all been asking. And then off to the right of my house door, I have right here is the closet. Um, like I said, it's miscellaneous stuff in here. So this is my closet. It's kind of deep, has everything that you would need. And I have my step stool. This is my best buddy since I got here. Okay. For the, my short girls. Um, yeah. So I have just some stuff up there. I have some paper towels and, you know, some miscellaneous stuff in there. From over here to my bathroom. So this is my bathroom. Y'all probably already seen this from the TikTok. So yeah, this is my bathroom. This is the toilet, my sink. Um, it has some nice, some storage space, which I really love. And underneath it also has, everything is like silent clothes. So, you know, you can open it and then, oh, I like that. <laughs> but <laughs> like this, and it quietly closed. See? And then under here, we have some more storage space. I just stored a, a gain <laughs> spray bottle here. And then here is my mirror. And it also lights up, which you would flick the switch right here and it'll turn blue and boom, the light turns on. 
<laughs> all right and as soon as when you open this i have my medicine cabinet as you see i have all my stuff here and you turn here and there's also another mirror okay period which i really really love about that super excited to do like skincare videos and stuff <laughs> top notch on a whole nother level okay so we're gonna flick that off and then here this is my shower right here it has a nice little light over it and i have like a peekaboo shower curtain that i had to just get from the the dollar store which is super cute which i love i'm trying to keep it the black aesthetic in my bathroom because of the simple fact of the accents like the shower head and the handles and everything is black in here so i'm definitely going to keep the aesthetic of it being black so this is my shower okay yep so yeah this is my shower y'all Everything's gonna look more put together when I do the, the little montage. And I have like a little rack. I can put my towel and my rag. Okay, so this is the bathroom. Super cute. And when you turn out from the bathroom, here is my living room. It's super, super cute. I just have this foldable chair. Like I said, y'all, if y'all see anything out of place, please bear with me. <laughs> but yeah, this is my living room. I'm really gonna turn off the lights because honestly, I don't need, well, except for the kitchen a little bit. I don't need all of the lights. But yeah, this is my living room. So here's my window. I'm just gonna keep that closed for simple fact of privacy. And here is like an AC slash heater thing, which you can operate from here. This is a light switch as well for the living room. And this is, this light is actually for that over there. So yeah. So that's that. And this is the monitor to work the AC slash uh, heat. So yeah, this is that. And then it opens like that, which is super cool. Like, look at that. <laughs> and then it blows cold air or hot air, depending on whatever setting you have it on. And the lowest it is is 67. And then off here is my bedroom. So this is my bedroom. Right here, it's kind of like, I don't want to say it's kind of small because you can fit a twin size bed in here. But on camera, it looks kind of big. But, you know, you can fit a, a twin size and I will hope and pray a queen size. Fingers crossed with that. Um, so, yeah, this is my bedroom. I just have the air mattress here, my iPad, because I'm about to edit. And this is my closet right here. All right, well, I got my hygiene stuff. And down here, I have my clothes, my dirty clothes down here. But, yeah, this is my closet um and yeah and then this is the and i have the same ac heating system up here as well and yeah that's it for my apartment this is my my nice little cozy apartment look at her Look at the woman, man. Look at her. Huh. That ain't my, that ain't my, that ain't my girl. That's my nigga. Catch me out on ocean drives with her. Hey. Catch me in the whip, ride with her. Hey. Sipping something, bumping big, hypnotized with her. Pray you get that job in Tampa. That's only four hours away. Take a car, take a plane, baby, whichever is faster. Oh, whichever one is in a hassle. Oh, damn, yeah, man. Oh, never knew, no, I never knew that you be a freak and a friend too. Yeah, you into everything I'm into. Oh, I got something that I can lend you. Oh, a peace of mind, baby, come and get a peace of mind. Yeah. Say you gotta work from three to nine. Oh, I get you home by a decent time. Wait, your bed, you can sleep in mine. Yeah, let's make it happen, girl, I need some time. Speaking of time, who stopped it? That's the feeling that I get when we lock lips. I got the weed at the crib and the liquor too. I fuck your soul, I release in your spiritual. I be your Guys, end of the video of the empty apartment tour. Let me know your thoughts down in the comment section down below. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And let me know some commentary on what apartment video should I do next. Like, I do have the moving vlog coming next, so make sure you guys stay tuned for that. But I'm just super, super excited for this new journey 
with my apartment and y'all know the content is gonna come baby so let me know what other like videos you guys want to see as far as like apartment related um yeah make sure you guys like comment subscribe and i'm gonna see y'all in my next video bye guys mm -hmm.